Friends from Kaularan High School. Today we will show you how to do the squashing the bottle activity. Our objective for that activity is to show the relationship among volume, temperature, pressure, and the number of moles. Our materials are 1.5 empty plastic bottle with cover, hot water, ice cubes, plastic, bag, and hammer. Procedure A number 1. Fill one-third of the bottle with hot water. Number two. After a few seconds, empty the bottle and put the cover at once. Procedure B. Put the ice cubes in the plastic bag and then crush it carefully with a hammer. Number two. Put the crushed ice cubes in the bottle. Put the cover on. Number three. Shake the hammer so that the inner portion is truly chilled and then observe the battle. Question number one for procedure A. What happened when you cover the battle? Our answer. The plastic battle deformed. Question number two for procedure A. What caused it to happen? Our answer. Because the water is too hot so that the battle is deformed. Question number three for procedure B. What happened to the bottle? Our answer, the bottle is cooled and the bottle slowly deformed as long as we shake it. Question number four for procedure B. Explain the phenomenon. Our answer, when we fill the bottle with hot water, it deformed past. While we fill the bottle with the crushed ice, the bottle cools down. And when we shake the bottle, the bottle deforms slowly and the ice turned into cold water. To solve the problem, the first thing you will do is to find the given. P is equal to 1.25 atm, N is equal to 0 0.50 mole, T is equal to 2, 25 degrees Celsius, but you need to convert it into Kelvin. To convert it, just add 273 Kelvin to the given temperature. So now, our temperature is 298 Kelvin. R is equal to 0 0.0821 liter atm, mole, and Kelvin. The formula for ideal gas law is PV equals nRT where P is pressure in atmosphere and V is volume in liter, N is the number of moles, T is temperature in Kelvin, and R is universal gas constant. So our solution will be V is equal to 0 0.50 mole times 0 0.0821 liter ATM mole and Kelvin times 298 Kelvin divided by 1.25 ATM. Cancel all the same unit that we have which is ATM mole and Kelvin. After that, times all the numerator 0 0.50 times 0 0.0821 times 298 that will be equal to 12.23 divided by 1.25 atm it is equal to 9.78 so that our final answer or our volume is 9.78 liter 